So productivity since 1979 has increased 86%, while hourly pay has only increased 32%. So workers in America have become more productive and are getting paid less for their productivity. In I mean, term, yeah, in terms of value of money. Yeah, and like, so you can see, like, it really took off during the Reagan presidency and then never looked back. Yeah. So yeah, the average annual growth in productivity you know, back in 1948 to 79, look at that, was 2.5% in productivity, 2.1% in compensation. Like, up until the 60s, it was pretty on par. It was pretty even. And there was some disparity going into the 70s, and then it started to widen some more. And then as soon as we get to the early 80s, it just explodes. And I mean, look at this discrepancy. It's getting, and I mean, it's getting worse. This gap is just widening and widening and widening. And, yeah. and people, yeah, you know, people are getting screwed because of it. Like if, if you, if you are getting paid the same, like, that's like, that's the thing now is I'm just going to throw it out there. Like if you're getting paid $75,000 today, if, if you were being paid at the productivity level, like if, if you're being paid as productive as you were being back in the seventies, you'd be making like $140,000. You'd be making almost double. Isn't that crazy? That's crazy. If, if, if wages simply kept up, you'd be making almost double than what the average worker would be making almost double what they are right now. If wages simply kept up with productivity. But, you know, everything's fine. A Anyways, lot of, a lot of a lot of people are out of touch with this, though. 